In this video, you will learn why keywords are so important to search engines. Why keywords? Keywords mean everything in the world of good search engine rankings. You see, the importance of using good keywords cannot be overstated enough. Keywords tell the search engines and other websites what your website is all about. Search engines and relevant content. The search engine tries to find the most relevant information across the entire internet. As the search is performed, each website in the directory is scanned for the information that matches what the user is searching for and returns the best possible results. The way in which the search engine performs this task is more or less based on the keywords that are used throughout the website. Here's an example. A good example would be a website that sells brand name products. If I sell specific brand of cell phones on my website versus selling general items, I am probably never going to rank higher than that brand name itself. But that doesn't mean you should give up. If your website were to sell a specific brand of cell phones, you might want to use keywords or keyword phrases specific to the product. There are many programs available to assist you with researching good keywords. Keyword density. Sprinkle your keywords across your entire website so that you end up with a keyword density of 3% to 6% at the most. If your keyword density is much higher than 6%, you may find your website banned from the search engines for spamming keywords. Now, if your keyword density is below 3%, you may find that your website will never get indexed simply because it doesn't have enough relevant information about your topic or niche. It may get indexed, but we're talking about rankings here. Search engine algorithms. The search engines are not stupid algorithms. In fact, they are highly sophisticated and they know if your site is trying to circumvent their procedures. There are several free tools available online to help you determine what your density percentages are for a given keyword. Use these free tools and analyze your site to make sure it is operating within these parameters. Don't forget to get specific. Once your website is ranked high for a specific term or keyword, continue to develop your niche and get very specific about the content your website offers. You want people to see your website as the absolute best place to find information they are looking for. This process is constantly changing and you will need to continue your efforts if you want success over the long run. Alright, so I just want to show you a few tools that you can use to find good keywords and also check your keyword density about with your articles and things like that so that you know that you're in the range of three to six percent. First thing I'm going to do is show you how to find good keywords. As you can see here, we're at Google in the search page and uh, one tool that I would suggest you using would be Word Tracker's free keyword tool. And to do that, to get there, all you have to do is go to google.com, search in Word Tracker free keyword tool, or go to freekeywords.wordtracker.com. So if you go to that site here, I'll actually go and click on it, and you'll notice here a keyword search area, and you can filter, remove a offensive and uh, things like that, or you can turn it off. Uh, but I'll keep that and I'll just say something like dog training. And you'll notice here that Word Tracker will show the results here. It'll show all the keywords on the right side and the searches on the left side. So this is a great way to find keywords and keyword phrases. Now if you want to dig further deep down into say hunting dog training, you can click on that link. And as you can see here, Word Tracker's free keyword tool will actually go deep down into the hunting dog training search and you'll find a lot of things here. So this is a great way to search for keywords. Another tool, as I mentioned in the video, was called Good Keywords. 
Uh, good Keywords is a free tool. It's a Windows tool. Uh, so you can download it and uh, search for good keywords. Very easy to use and very powerful. Now let's go down to keyword density. Let's say that you're writing an article or you're writing a blog and you want to check the keyword density of that content. What you can do is go to Google and type in check keyword density and you'll find a lot of free tools. There are some tools that are paid uh, but you really don't need to and uh, you can check this first one enter the URL of your website and you can analyze the keyword density right away so these are some free tools that you can use and you can get started with good keywords word trackers free tool all free the keyword density tools